so come be part of it. For free tickets, visit SteveWilkos.com and click on tickets or call 1-877-74-STEVE. Other than with Lottie, have you ever exchanged any type of sex act for anything of value with another male? She answered no, and the results came back all the same for her lie detector test, and they came back that Sean T did not tell the truth. I don't like the fact that you do the checking. Uh, the, 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 it, yeah, the I have my reasons, though. You I had your reasons, reasons, but there's still a way to handle certain situations that you don't degrade somebody no matter what they're doing. Right. And that's what you're doing to a woman. Right. On, on that note, <clears throat> on that note, though, you did have reason to be suspicious, probably. Right. Right. Uh, he took the same test that you did. Okay. He passed. And I, for, I would, if I was a gambling man, which sometimes I am, I would say that he was going to fail and you were going to pass. But, you know, you failed the lie detector test and you failed all three questions. All three. And we gave you, the, and how, you know, how many times did we give you the test? Right. Like two. two times. Mm -hmm. And we gave it to you two times. The fact is, this is a relationship that goes up and down, right, that you right. both have cheated in the past. Uh, this isn't the first yeah. time. I was just trying to clarify this and get it out the way, you know, because I did my dirt yet, okay. you know. And, even, if, even though she failed this lie detector test, I, I, I obviously there is some love yeah. for each other. She's right. the mother of your three children. Yeah. Is there any yeah. way to work and say, you know what, let's stop lying to each other. Let's stop the foolishness yeah, and let's be a loving couple. Yeah. Can you do that? I can do that because she, I've been always saying this is all I've been doing. You know what I'm saying? But with me, you know, it's a different story. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, we sat down, talked about this, and put things behind us, move on. Can you just life. be with you know this one saying? woman? This is yeah. a possibility. I mean, you know, I, I can't call it. I can't call it. I can't make no decisions right now, but, you know, it's on national TV now. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know? I, for the sake of your children, I hope you give them another shot. I'm all if it does, I hope they do it. Appreciate it. Uh, nice meeting you. Good luck to you. the Steve Wilco Show live. For free tickets, visit stevewilcos.com and click on tickets or call 1-877-74-STEVE. You can ruin his life. I did not slide. go to my daughter You're to say that. I'm going to come with it. That's my Listen, he's, fa he's passing all his tests. You're failing yours. Lie detector tests are fake. I did not. I did well, not. Why did you try to say that? Wait, wait. I wouldn't put her through that. Like, I, why would I go to her to say that? Please involve the child. Like, nobody's believing your story. People are I don't care what this. nobody believes. I know I didn't go to her to say it. But, so I don't care. But, okay, listen. My only point is this. Why not stop making the accusations? Because you know they're not true. Let the guy live his life. Let the guy be a father to your children. Stop trying to destroy the guy. That's it. That's all I, I don't care about what she made up. I just want to see my kids. What I want listen, to see my kids. Uh, listen, nobody's going to ask you to ever come back here again. You don't have to come on the Steve Wilco show, but don't cause drama in your own life. And you don't have to. Why would I do that? You know, why would I do that? We don't care. I did not do that. Destroy someone, put them in jail, 
Because that's what, if the police came and said, oh, yeah, you did this, we think you wasted your child, this guy could go to jail. He hasn't done anything. You obviously are lying about it. Now, I don't give a damn about that. I do give a damn. You shouldn't be lying. You shouldn't be doing this to this guy. But why don't you just stop? Let him be a father. Let him spend time with his daughters. Stop trying to destroy the guy. Can you do that? It's a simple yes, yeah, Steve. No, he's not seeing my kids. I don't care what nobody talks well, about. Well, like, okay. I did not no, okay. That, like, okay, but you don't get to make that decision. Yes, I do. And I think if you go home and get somebody to help you out, and we could probably refer you to some drugs. I appreciate it. I will, you need I will, to get your yep, rights. School, yep. I, got, I got everything I need now. That's all you need to know. And you know what? I like, might talk to the police. Like, That's up to you. <laughs> But somebody's filing false police reports against you. Yeah, them. a lot. Because I know, I love my kids. The show ends now. You need to stop. You need to grow up. You need to stop making false accusations against the father of your children. And if you keep doing it, and when your daughters are old enough to see this, you know who they're going to start hating? You. Because they're going to say, why did you do this to daddy? So before you go down that road, of ruining the relationship that you're going to have with your daughters concerning their father, I would wake up, be a mature adult, and let this guy co-parent with you with your daughters. Smiles, good luck to you. If there's anything we can do for you, let us know. Share and repeat. Race, resentment, and the DNA truth. All of the drama continues. I want to thank all of my guests for appearing on the show today. I want to thank everybody who watches so loyally every day. I want to thank my life today.